Hey, what's going on? Welcome welcome back to another video on the Poor Man's Gold channel. Um, I scored another piece of gold, and I'm totally digging it. Um, if you're wondering where the other piece of gold is, I don't know if you can see it from all the way over there, but it's that tiny little speck over there. Um, I'm only kidding with you. It's a, uh, it's a, it's a, a dos peso. It's a Mexican gold. Um, dos pesos. Um, I went for the random date. I got it off eBay, Liberty Coin, so I'm pretty confident in the uh, authenticity of it. Um, but the random dates were running like $10, $15 cheaper than the 1945s. And I was wondering what's with the 1945s. So I went for the random date. I was like, if if 45 is something special, I don't need a 45, whatever. So, um, and then uh, the random dates actually got like a 10% off or something. It went down from like, I don't know, 125 or 135, something like that, down to 115. So I was like, you know what? For, for 115, I'm, you know, I, I, I'm jumping on it. So um, I went for the random dater, um, not the 1945, which seemed to be getting a little more money. And my random dater came back as a 1945. Um, this is a pretty small coin. Um, I think it's like 1.67 grams uh, total. And I think, I I'm pretty sure it's one, one and a half grams of actual silver. It's 90% silver here. So I think we got an actual gold weight of uh, one and a half grams. But it's, uh, it's pretty cool. It's Mexican gold. You got that uh, eagle on the back doing whatever it's doing. It says uh, Estados Unidos Mexicanos. Uh, I'm not. Um, I'm not uh, by. Uh, I'm not like um, you know what do they call it? like a uh, bicunnilingual or anything. Uh, in other words, I'm not like a a bicunnilinguist. But I think um, that that probably stands for the United States of Mexico. I've never heard it really referred to as the United States of Mexico, but who am I? What do I know? Um, but it's a pretty cool little piece, and um, I'm digging it. A little reeded edge there. And it's a, a 1945 Mexican gold. You can't go wrong. How can you go wrong with Mexican gold, man? And Mexican friggin' metals, they're hot right now. I don't, you know, I don't know uh, why, but... The Libertads, the Mexican gold, the Mexican silver, it's 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 hot. So, um, I'm I'm digging it. It's a very small coin. Uh, you can see it next to the uh, the dime there, or on top of the dime. It's pretty small. The only reason I'm including this dime in the video, this uh, 1943s winged Liberty Mercury dime. 43 us this mother this mother flower is black but it's in fair condition and um I found this in oh, I, I didn't really find it in but actually I did find it in but I got change back uh on something and this was in the change and I was like score awesome the first person I thought of was bullion baby but um anyway this, uh, the, the dime really has nothing to do with the video. Just wanted to show off a um, 1943S black um, in the wild. Got back as change. So um, I'm adding to the gold stack here. Um, the one gram IGR uh, gold gram. And now the 1945 random date um, Mexican dos pesos. One, one and a half grams of gold. For one and a half grams of gold, it looks a little smaller than the one gram bar, but I don't know. What do I know, right? So uh, I'm just digging it. I'm adding gold to the stack. It's not like big, huge purchases of gold going in the stack. But the thing is, um, even small pieces add up. That's the bottom line. Um, and technically, I got this one on January 31st, and I got this one in February. So, I mean, maybe it's not, you know, the one-tenth ounce challenge or anything but you know what i mean uh january february who knows by march i may have another one we'll see what happens but the bottom line is is here that um scored another piece of gold dos pesos 1945 
You cannot go wrong. And it's a pretty cool little design on there. And it's a little pretty cool little piece of gold to add to the stack. So uh, I'll let you guys go on this video. Just wanted to show off the new, you know, gold score. And um, I'm loving the gold. Uh, Mexican gold. <laughs> you can't go wrong, right? So uh, bottom line here is I'll talk to you guys soon. Keep out of trouble. Stay safe. Thanks for watching. And I'm totally digging um, the gold and Mexican gold. You can't go wrong. And uh, yeah, so catch you guys soon.